I'ma flirt. Soon as I see her, walk up in the club, I'ma flirt. Winging eyes at me when I pull up on them clubs, I'ma flirt. Sometimes. I'm What's up, Diamond Squad? It's your girl Snag Diamond, and I'm back again with another video. Today, I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to put on a clip on ponytail yes i find doing a how to video you blend hair <laughs> yes i've been wanting to do hair videos for a while and i finally i finally did it I finally did it <laughs> but um yeah so if you want to know how i put this on then i don't know why i just keep getting braids like like i said if you want to know how to put this on then keep on watching the video okay <laughs> all right all right so before i get started my hair look crazy right now i just washed my hair that's why it looks so short like this so yeah every time i wash my hair it looks short like that but i i'm telling you my hair my hair is that long okay but um yeah i'm going to be teaching you guys like i said before how to do a ponytail now in my video yeah you guys been saying that my hair looks nice or stuff like that um i bought a new hair because obviously this hair is just this hair is just so bad like i know you're probably gonna say like girl if this if this weaves not good no what like why did you um put this on um i didn't have this on in a lot of my videos i had a, this one on in a lot of my videos now this one i don't really go outside with because this one is brown and it doesn't really go on my hair as much so this one is a little bit messed up but it's not that messed up like how this one is this one is complete garbage now it's stiff so yeah i can wash them like i do have clip on hairs too that i wash and i blow dry it comb it out and everything and it comes back as brand new but this one is going to be a bit harder so if i could try to get it um the same shape again i will and i know you could use curling iron for these too there's some synthetic this is by the way this is synthetic hair so i know there's some synthetic hair that you can like use a curling iron for so this is the one that I bought. As you can see in the picture, it's all long like that. And it comes in like this thing right here. And you just gotta pull this out. And of course it has the net on it. So just take out the net. And first of all, this hair is very soft, it's curly. As you can see, I really like it when it's soft like this when I first get it. But this type of hair, especially like synthetic hair, you really need to like take a really good care of it because synthetic hair can get really stiff and it's really hard to comb through or brush through. So you really want to take care of these hair. Now it does come with a comb like this, but I don't like those. So one thing is you have the option to remove it because like you know just like that so i'm gonna go ahead and remove this and then i'm gonna be back finally got it out it's hard to take this out like because it's really in there like i even pinched my finger with it but um yeah this is synthetic hair like i said i haven't actually seen real human hair that has the clips with it and has these on it i haven't seen real human hair that's for a ponytail you know i know like you can buy human hair and you can wrap it around your hair but you know i like the ones that come with these little clip thingies right here to clip onto your hair so that's how it is without the clip so now before i get started um first what i do is i use gel you can use any type of gel i use any type of gel too but i use this one for now so you just want to first you want to like comb out your hair Make sure it's not knotted or anything. My hair keeps getting knotted. Like, it's alright. After that, I just take some gel and just put it on my hair. 
I'm gonna fast forward it. I the gel because you know I want the hair to stay down. And one thing, I like the curly ponytails a lot better because my hair is curly itself. And you know when I put the gel, it's curly, right? So you know a lot of people think that this is my real hair when I put the curly ponytail on. And you know it makes sense because if you have the straight one and you put gel in your hair, your hair is gonna be curly here, and then you're gonna have a straight ponytail, so that's not gonna be look good. I used to wear the straight ponytails when I would get my hair straight, but then I stopped getting tired of them and I really enjoyed the curly ones a lot better. So yeah, so I'm gonna just add a little bit of more of the gel. And next, basically what you wanna do, you could either put your bun right here, but I don't like my bun right there. I like it, hold on. I like it right here on the top, like that. So it gave me like that, that Ariana Grande type, you know, hair style. So you just take a scrunchie and you just tie it. I tie it three times, but you know what I mean. I go around three times. And then your bun does not have to be perfect. Does not have to be perfect. And then, what I usually used to do, I used to wait for it to dry. But what I just do is not, and I, I blow dry it until it's dry. I don't really know the time because I don't really time it. Make mostly what you would just do, I would just blow dry it. And then once I feel like everything is dry, then I'm all good. So I'm going to be right back. Thing before I blow dry it. Um, I use these big pins for the back because the back be sticking out and you you don't want the back to stick out so i just pin the back and pin the other side so that you know when i blow dry it it doesn't really stick out as much so yeah okay so after you are done blow drying your hair after everything is you know dry and everything like that i feel like i put this a bit too low but yeah, anyways, after everything is a bit dry, because you want it to really, really be dry, because if the gel does touch this, it does mess it up, and does mess up the curls, so you don't want that. So yeah, as I was blow drying my hair, my hair did get more puffy, like, you know, the lint got more bigger, but that's fine. So first of all, before I put this on, I have to take this out with my scissors. So... How did this even happen? Come on now. Okay. So, you want to... Where's the thing at? I'm just gonna cut this off of the thing. Okay. I didn't mean to throw that there. It just happened to... I just happened to throw it there, but... Okay. So you have this, you have this a string piece right here, and then you have these two clip ones, one for the front and one for the back. These two combs, make actually. So what you want to do is the front one and the back one. You want to have it like this, open like that. I don't know if you can see that, but, and then you want to just put it, oh, put the bun in there. Once the bun is in there, take those two clip thing, those two comb thingies, clip thingies, whatever you want to call them, and just push it in. Now, for the string, I'm trying to get, find the string. For the string, right? Oh my god, I lost the string again. For the string, you want to pull the string so it can be tighter. Then you want to wrap the string around your wrap it around the bun. Wrap it around the bun. And then once it reach towards here, you want to take a pin. Hold on. The pin. So I'll take the small pin because these small pins don't hurt as much as the big ones do. Because I'm telling you when when it was the first time I didn't when 
actually when I didn't even know how to put these ponytails on um I would have the Dominican people do it for me and they use these big ones and they put so much on my head I just when I was in the salon it wasn't really hurting me but since I got outside oh my god it was hurting me because it was so tight like ever since that I do my ponytails by myself okay <laughs> All right, after you've done that, you want to then take another of those and just, you know, pin it down because you don't want um, any of it um, sticking out or whatever, you know. And I have hair sticking out right here. I know that, but, you know, it's okay. And I know the hair looks brown on camera because of the sun's reflecting on it. But honestly, when the sun's not reflecting on it, it matches my hair color. Because this is the right one for my hair. Because this matches um, the black. And you also want to pin on the back too to keep it secure so it does not move. And... I'm trying to see how that Hey guys, that's basically it. How to put um, a ponytail on. Um, I would fleek my edges, but you know, I don't have a toothbrush. Wait, do I have a toothbrush to, to fleek my edges? Because, like, I only have one toothbrush to wash my teeth. Duh, but I don't have, like, one to, like, fleek my edges or whatever. But, um, all I can possibly do is just probably, like, do a little bit like that. But hold on, I'm going to see if I can find a toothbrush. Hey guys, I found this small little brush. This could work. So, I'm going to try to flick my edges, guys. I'm not really good at fleeking them. Like, there was only one time I did it so good. But. Yeah. Trying to, like, get all the baby hairs there. I'm obviously not really doing it good. I know that, but. I'm trying my best, okay? I'm not perfect. Okay, I'm gonna just do this off camera, guys. Alright, guys, I tried to fleek them. It didn't really go as well. If I was in a bigger mirror, it would have looked better, but I decided to go in a bigger mirror. But I tried, I tried. And as you can see now, when the sun is not on me, the hair actually goes in my hair. So, yeah, guys, this was just a little tutorial, easy tutorial on how to put like these clip on ponytail thingies and yeah and i like to i like to put it like this in my videos or in general because you know apparently when i put it not apparently but yeah i like doing it like this and stuff but yeah i'm telling you when the first time i came across the clip on these clip on ponytails like i used to in middle school i used to like have like the shorter ones and oh my god, I did not know how to put it correctly. Like, um, it had this in it too. I didn't get it from the same um store though. And I tried using that and all that stuff. I put it so bad in middle school. Oh my god, the string was even showing. I didn't even like pin it down or nothing. Like, <sighs> and then you know I started liking the longest a lot better. Like this is the longest one, the longest curly one that they have. So, um, yeah, girl. So, I'm going to try to keep this one in good condition. <sighs> I'm going to try. Because if this if gel touches this, it's going to mess up. And I don't want that. And this can last you long. As long as you keep it in good condition. As long as you don't get gel in it. And keep your hair really, um, make sure that your gel... Make sure your hair is really dry so you can put this on after you blow dry it or if you choose to blow dry it. And yeah, you guys, give this video a like, comment down below, subscribe if you're new, follow me on my social medias down in the description box. And 
email me for collaboration or business if you're interested in doing that and subscribe to my second channel smiling corneal and yeah the link to the second channel is in the description so i made it easier for you guys and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video i'm feeling this hair i like i like when hair when you get new hair and it's so soft and yes this the fact that this synthetic hair it doesn't like really tingled quick you know like this one doesn't tingle that quick i know there's a lot of synthetic hairs that do tingle quick but this one doesn't tingle quick unless you really like do something to mess it up then yeah but yeah i'll see you guys in the next video bye guys that's my choice. Get money, get money like a camera. Make the money, do it. Make the money.